Howard County warmly welcomes you to get off the highway and get on our scenic byway of the historic National Road. The Patapsco River does follow through to the Patapsco Valley State Park, one of Maryland's first state parks and an absolute mecca for persons that are interested in mountain biking. Also at the foot of the river is the B&O Railroad Museum, the Ellicott City Station, which is the oldest surviving railroad terminus in the United States. A very kid-friendly, very touch-friendly museum. You can climb through a caboose and there's often living historians there that will interact with you and tell the story of the rails. Along Main Street in Ellicott City, there are 55 plus shops and restaurants and you can get anything from fine French to Asian fusion to sippable chocolate. Uh, seasonally, there is outdoor Shakespeare that is performed in the stabilized ruins at the Patapisco Female Institute and the Chesapeake Shakespeare Company makes that place come to life every summer and every fall. You also could take a literary pub crawl through town for persons that uh, like to eat locally. There's a farmer's market on the second Sunday in Ellicott City, a first Friday where the shops are open late and a third Thursday girls' night out that is great for shopping and dining in town. Moving a little bit further west, there are the historical attractions of the Ellicott City Colored School. Going on even further west, there are terrific golf courses that you can enjoy and terrific pick-your-own produce farms like Laraland Farm in the western part of Howard County. There are terrific county parks along the way that you can enjoy. Every season brings a variety of events to enjoy along the historic National Road from Ellicott City all the way out west to Lisbon and beyond. In January, we have Restaurant Weeks that kicks off on Martin Luther King Day and runs for two weeks. In the springtime during the month of April, we have planted 1,600 cherry trees throughout the county. And while those cherry trees are blossoming, we usher in a season called our April Cherry Bration Days. In the summertime, there is the plein air where we invite regional artists from the Mid-Atlantic as we go into the fall, and that's when our farms are absolutely magnificent. And the pumpkin patches and the, the different sort of seasonal offerings at the farms in the fall are absolutely terrific. As it gets a little bit more brisk, um, there's caroling through town throughout the month. In western Ellicott City at the Shrine of St. Anthony, there's a live nativity. There's also mansion tours, candlelight mansion tours, and, and holiday teas at our mansions along the road in the west. For every season, on every mile of the road, at every time of the year, and at every budget, there's something that um, can keep you busy and keep you entertained and, and keep you coming back to Howard County for more.